Okay. In the Fondazione Cerere, we are happy to show the work, the Lanchin Four and uh, uh, Memories of Mirror. Uh, the two films are shown in uh, 16 millimeters. That is important because uh, part of the work, part of, of your work, the most important part is uh, um, showing this film uh, in, in uh, uh, this cinematographic um, uh, originality. So why you use? Uh, 16 millimeters, and uh, um, which is your idea uh, in, in, in these two words, uh, in this space, because the, the, the words are installed as a cinema, cinematographic uh, perspective? Um, I like to use 16 millimeter to kind of achieve an archival look and um, play with this idea of staged histories and with this ambiguity uh, of fiction or of history or of uh, fictionalized history. And um, um, these two films play with um, icons from the early 20th centuries and I restage uh, in one of them Mary Oppenheim and Joseph Baker and Dorma in a, in a meeting when they're older. And the other one is a restaged uh, performance uh, of uh, the dance party Mary Wigman. Uh, did you enjoy to stay in the Pacific show? Which is the difference to show this kind of works in a gallery and to show in a, in a, in a uh, uh, public space like this? I mean, in a no profit space that. Uh, uh, which is your relationship with the architecture? Um, and I how think we chose together to show two films which is perfect for the place and for me it doesn't make so much difference. I'm always happy if I have the opportunity to show the, the work in a way as I want to install it, which means uh, on 60mm on the film or in, in circumstances that the projection, you know, that everything works nicely. And uh, in, especially in the second room, it's very nice because it's, you know, it's a long space and it has a very cinema, a feeling of a cinema with this projector in the room, so it's, it's beautifully installed. Yeah. And uh, um, uh, you spent three months uh, in Rome, which is your uh, idea of Rome? I mean, we, um, which kind of perspective do you have uh, from the city? Uh, and uh, uh, there is something that uh, is uh, coming up uh, from these experiences. Um, I really felt in love with that town, <laughs> honestly. Uh, it has a very, very rich history and I, I did spend a lot of time to just walk around and discover the the city and look at all the archae archaeological sites and uh, I mean there's too much to see in three months but uh, I will use parts of it in my work and what I did use a little bit and I think it's a place where I will always come back or maybe we use in future. Yeah, because history and time and that, um, yeah. yeah, there's lots of the layers of you know the way architecturally all these different times you can see uh, in one place so it's very unique thank you so much <laughs> for being here and thank for you. staying in Rome and for enjoying food I do <laughs> enjoy food <laughs> thank you yes. <laughs>